Gabriel Mouton was a French abbot and scientist. He was a doctor of theology from Lyon, but was also interested in mathematics and astronomy. His 1670 book, The Observationist Diametrorum Solis et Lunar Apparentium, proposed a natural standard of length based on the circumference of the Earth, and was decimally divided. It was influential in the adoption of the metric system in 1799. The milia, based on the measurements of the size of the Earth conducted by Riccioli of Bologna, Mouton proposed a decimal system of measurement based on the circumference of the Earth, explaining the advantages of a system based on nature. Mouton's publication appeared two years after John Wilkins, then president of the Royal Society, published a similar proposal. His suggestion was a unit, the milia, that was defined as a minute of arc along a meridian arc, and a system of subunits dividing successively by factors of 10 into the centuria, decuria, verga, virgula, decimas, centesimas, and millesima. The verga, one one-thousandth of a minute of arc, corresponding to 64.4 bologna inches, or tilde 2.04 meters, was reasonably close to the then-current unit of length. The Parisian toys, a feature which was meant to make acceptance of the new unit easier. As a practical implementation, Mouton suggested that the actual standard be based on pendulum movement, so that a pendulum located in Lyon of length 1 virgula would change direction 3959.2 times in half an hour. The resulting pendulum would have a length of tilde 20.54 cm. Wilkins, however, proposed using a pendulum that was 0.994 meters in length. His ideas attracted interest at the time, and were supported by Jean Picard as well as Wiegens in 1673, and also studied at Royal Society in London. In 1673, Leibniz independently made proposals similar to those of Mouton. It would be over a century later, however, that the French Academy of Sciences Weights and Measures Committee suggested the decimal metric system that defined the meter as, at least initially, a division of the circumference of the Earth. The first official adoption of this system occurred in France in 1791. By today's measures, his milia corresponds directly to a nautical mile, and his verga would by definition have been 1.852 meters.